which of the following is a solution to the given equation? So we have this quadratic here, and we need to find its solutions, but we know we can't use grouping to factor this, because all of these answer choices, they have square roots in them. So we either need to complete the square or use the quadratic formula. So we can just use the quadratic formula, which says that x, or in this case w, w is, which is the variable, w is equal to negative b plus minus square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a, where a, b, and c are the coefficients and the constants. So a is the coefficient of the second degree term, b is the coefficient of the first degree term, and c is the constant. So in this case, a is 1, b is 12, c is negative 40. So let's plug in those values. So w equals negative b, so negative 12 plus minus b squared, so 12 squared, 144, minus 4 times a c. a is 1, so 4 times 1 is 4, times negative 40. 4 times negative 40 is negative 160, but there is a negative here and a negative here, so two negatives multiplied gives us a positive. So this will be a positive 160. And all of that will be over 2a, where a is 1, so 2. So now we can just simplify this, quadra uh, this square root here. So we'll have negative 12 plus minus square root of 144 plus 160. That's just equal to 304. All of that over 2. So 304 is actually equal to 16 times 19. You can verify that in your calculator. And so we can rewrite this as negative 12 plus minus 16 times 19 over 2. And the square root of 16, that's just equal to 4. So we can take the 4 out. And then we can divide the whole thing by 2. So let's do that over here. So w will equal negative 12 divided by 2. That's equal to negative 6. 4 divided by 2, that's just equal to 2 times square root of 19. So now we have our solutions to the equation. So this plus minus means that this is either a plus or a minus. Both are solutions. So one solution is negative 6 plus the square plus 2 times the square root of 19. And the second solution is negative 6 minus 2 times the square root of 19. So both of these are solutions. But the only one that's up here is answer choice D. It has this solution here. So D is the correct answer.